Hey there, penguins. Detective Flippers here. Every day we spend tons of time on devices. Whether it be our phones, Chromebooks, or iPads, technology and the internet help every single one of us every single day. It's something we definitely couldn't live without. This is why we need to become cyber experts to help keep every penguin safe while using the web. Listen closely because I'm going to give you five super easy, super cool, and super important tips to being the perfect digital penguin. You ready? Let's go! Tip number one, keep your personal information personal. Your phone number, financial information, address, and email should always stay private. That being said, talking to someone or even friending someone you don't know on social media is a bad move. Know that it's okay to say no. Tip number two, passwords, passwords, passwords. When you're signing up for an email, social media, or any new account, you may have seen they ask you for a password. For hackers, it's easy to use the easiest passwords they can find and take your information. The fancy word for this is called identity theft, when bad guys use your information to fake as you on the internet. So don't put common phrases like hello, 12345, or even password as your password. Instead, use combinations of numbers, symbols, capitals, and lowercase letters to make a complex password. Tip number three, reeling in the fish. It's important to know fish when you see one. Have you ever gone fishing? You may have gone fishing for these type of fish, but not fish. A phishing attack is a fake email sent from hackers to look as if a real organization is emailing you. They're just trying to get you to click on a link or attachment that they put in an email. How can you tell if an email is a fish? You can tell if the email address is not known to you, if it's too good to be true, if there's an odd link, or if there are many spelling errors. Malware is a virus installed on your device by bad guys when you click a link or download something malicious. Malware can cause a great deal of damage to your device, but there is a fix. Think of when you're sick. We take medicines to feel better and prevent us from getting sicker. In the same way, we can install helpful anti-malware on our devices to help combat these malicious viruses. Some malware is found on free downloads, like apps and games. So don't trust it on your computer before you've run a security check or you trust the source. On your phones, make sure you're careful when you download apps and games. Make sure you question who's running the app and check out previous reviews or other apps the owner has made, just to be sure 100% that it's not malicious. Tip number five, perfect posting. You may have heard of Instagram or Snapchat. These are social media sites. However, many social media sites have age restrictions. My advice to you is to follow these age restrictions as they are there for your safety. But as you get older, you will start using these social media sites to network and collaborate with your peers. Regardless, you should make sure that you're being kind and posting respectfully using your devices. Cyberbullying is never the answer. Remember, what you do online is a reflection of who you are as a penguin. Be sure to follow the same penguin principles you follow at school. Be respectful, responsible, helpful, and safe while using the internet. There it is, your starter tips to the cyber world. As the tech world gets larger, we need to stay safe and keep others safe on the internet. And remember, it's the simple steps of precaution that we can take every day that count, even by asking an adult before clicking a link or making sure there's no one peeking behind you while you type in a password. You made it! Congrats on earning your badge, Penguin! Now it's your job to pass these tips along to your friends and family. This is Detective Flippers, signing off. Created using Powtoon.